If you're like me, you've never considered the Bible a book about food. A portal to recognize God's voice in your life? Sure. An encouraging guide to awake to the wonder of God? Of course. But a foodie roadmap? That may feel like a stretch. Yet as I've read the Bible with fresh eyes, I've become increasingly convinced that one of the least discussed and most powerful attributes of God is that God is a foodie. Now, a foodie is simply someone who takes a particular interest in food. And if you look at the Bible, you'll discover food pops and sizzles on almost every page. So in Taste and See, I decided to explore the agrarian themes of scripture, to study food in the Bible, to uncover the transformative spiritual power of this delicious imagery firsthand. With so many rich passages, I needed to narrow my search. So I hand-selected six foods, the perfect number of ingredients for the perfect meal. And through this journey, I discovered a God I never knew existed, a master chef who still rains down spiritual nourishment like daily bread. By encountering the father of all fruit, you will discover the sweetness of finding your satisfaction in God. By encountering the mighty fisherman, you will discover the rich bounty of God's provision so you can trust more. By encountering the feast maker, you will discover the ultimate meal that your soul craves. I'm confident that if you take this journey with me, God will serve up the same experience for you. Because this will not just be a journey of food, but one of faith. The Bible's culinary passages, like all scripture, are intended to feed our souls, not just our bellies. My hope is that you won't just read and learn, but that you will taste and see God's goodness.